the Rose Bowl is not the biggest stadium, it's not the loudest stadium, but I want to tell you right now, it is the most beautiful sight in college football. At the end of that third quarter, Keith, when that sun starts going down in the Rose Bowl, there's nothing like it. It is a grand game. It is a grand stadium. There are a few events left in this country. The tradition stands. You talk to players and coaches around the country, and they will say to you, I would love to take a team to the Rose Bowl. But you can't pass through life without becoming acquainted with tradition, with legacy, and with the feeling of history, and the Rose Bowl does all of that. From the very first game in 1902, played at Tournament Park, to some of the most memorable college football contests ever. And as the game moves forward to a newly renovated stadium ready for the Rose Bowl game centennial. The Rose Bowl is a game of firsts. The first postseason college football bowl game. The first national radio broadcast of a sporting event back in 1927. The first bowl game to have 100,000 fans in attendance. That was 1950. The first nationally televised bowl game in 1952. And the Rose Bowl game was the first college football game to be broadcast nationally in color in 1962. The Rose Bowl game's place in college football history will never be surpassed. As the Rose Bowl game marches toward 100, its passion, strength, tradition, and honor continue to make it the granddaddy of them all.